Ladies and gentlemen, step around, step around. Come on, gather around, gather around. I'm gonna show you a little way to make a little easy money today. You understand what I'm saying? These are the blacks. Don't follow the blacks. You wanna follow the queen? You know why? Because she's red, and that means she is hot. So you gotta find the queen, find the queen. The first of the day is free to play. Who wants to play? You look interesting, my man. You wanna step on up? Come on now, who wants to play? Oh, what about you, sweetie? You cute? Come on up. Come on over here and play. Cute girls with money, don't they? Hey, baby, you look lucky now. You look lucky now. Follow the queen. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Follow the queen, follow the queen. She ain't no Helen Mirren, but this queen is for you. Which one? Which one? Which one is it? Which one is it? It's right there. Right there? Bam! Oh, yeah. uh, beginner's luck, beginner's luck. I'll tell you what. It takes a woman to know a woman, it takes a lady to find a queen. There you go. There. Oh. You wanna double up? Alright, here we go. We got a chance. We got a chance. We got a chance. Alright, here we go. Here we go. All we gotta do is find your queen. You will not win again. You will not win again. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Find your queen. Find your queen. Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? Boom. Can you find her? Right there. This one? That's what I think. Oh, my God. She is killing me. She is taking all my rent. Anybody else want to get behind the good luck, girl? I can do it. You can do it? All right. Your next horn. Just give me a chance to recover and get my money back, girl. So I'm going to be out here sleeping on the street, not just playing. Here we go. All right, ready? This is the last time. I'm not messing with you no more. You're taking all my money, girl. I ain't messing with you no more. Here we go. One more chance. This is the last chance. You go follow the queen, baby. Follow the queen. Where's she at? Where's she at? Just one time. I'll show you one time, and there she is. Boom, boom, boom. Pick a card. I can't decide. No, what do you mean? Just pick a card. Just make a decision. I can't decide. Come on, any card to do. Left, right, center. I don't... I don't know. Do you want the right? I don't know. I... The left? The center? I don't know. I... Move out the way and just let somebody else play then? I can't decide. I... I can't. You want to flip a coin for it? What's, what's wrong with me? Get okay? Scariest 30 seconds of my life. I couldn't do anything. It's like I couldn't move inside my head. It's called abulia, the inability to make a decision or exercise will. Is it gonna happen again? It's part of a TIA, a transient ischemic attack. Blood was cut off to a section of your frontal lobe. Is it like a stroke or something? A little. What drugs have you taken recently? No drugs. Toxins are another possibility. You might have been exposed to something at work, for instance. No real job right now. Exposure can build up over time and lie dormant for a while. What was your last job? Pet store. Exotic pets? Travical fish. And before that? Unemployment. And before that, uh, I sold subscriptions on the phone. And before that, unemployment. Before that, um, I worked at Jeans Gone Wild. Before that, unemployment. Before that, uh, I walked dogs and before that. Uh... Loss of free will. I like it. Maybe we can get Thomas Aquinas in for a consult. What caused the TIA? Arteries are clear, no sign of a clot. Could have dissolved. Most likely came from her heart. We should do a bubble study. Clots are unlikely in a 28-year-old's not on the pill. It's probably a vasospasm caused by drugs. I don't think so. She goes from job to job. Maybe there's some kind of ADD here. Help us pinpoint where the neurological... She goes from job to job because she's a scam artist. She works just long enough to qualify for unemployment, then gets fired and gets high. I still don't think it's drugs. Did you check for infection? LP showed nothing, no fever, white blood count is normal. Could be toxic exposure. You're the one always saying it must be drugs. You figure she's a minority? She must be stunned? You know that's not what she I... She seems like a nice girl. You haven't met her. She was pregnant at 15, dropped out of high school. She's a real overachiever. Come on, cut her some slack. Her baby died of SIDS. This isn't some romantic story about a nice girl scarred by tragedy. She's a drug-using scam artist scarred by tragedy. On the other hand, the talk screen just came back. She's clean. You're wasting my time. He's wasting... That isn't mine. It was in your closet. <laughs> It belongs to this guy who used to live with me. <coughs> you might want to let him know he's got arsenic poisoning. We should get a sample of his hair so we can see the extent. <coughs> but I don't do... <coughs> I don't do drugs. <coughs> get a crash guard in here. Respiratory arrest. Are you sure it isn't from the arsenic? Dr. Foreman said I was poisoned. Your hair showed only a trace amount. Not enough to damage your lungs like this. We need you to stay still now. Six millimeter cuts starting at the apices. Also, I just wanted to let you know, should you change your mind, I'll be available. Aren't you getting tired of hearing me say it? 
I have no intention of going out with you, of having sex with you, of doing anything with you, except work. We don't have to make a big deal about it. I just thought I'd let you know. I decided Tuesdays would be a good day to do that. You did not suddenly fall in love with me. You were looking for something, and I happened to be scared. Karen, it's fine. No need to go on about it. Advancing through the long bases. We need to put this behind us. Understood. But you keep bringing it up. You're the one who's still talking. Look, I'm not demanding anything from you. I'm not following you home. I've got no expectations. A gentle, polite reminder once a week is hardly stalking. There's a mass just outside the lingula. Biopsy shows there are white blood cells in the walls of the blood vessels. They're not supposed to get past the bouncers. It's got to be autoimmune. Something lymphocytic. White blood cells are attacking your own body. The only question is what kind of autoimmune? It doesn't matter what kind. It always matters what kind. Treatment's always steroids. Treatment is always boring. Diagnosis. OK. It's affecting the larger blood vessels. It's got to be giant cell arteritis. I'll start on steroids. It's affecting the smaller blood vessels. Got to be lupus vasculitis. I'll start on steroids. It's affecting. Yeah. Got it. Start on steroids. Good idea. Told you, that was boring. I gotta go out. Why? Wilson's got a date. It's got 15 foot ceilings, it's an open. <coughs> How you feeling? That wasn't my crack pipe. You told me. Are you tired? Or... I just took a hit off it a couple of times. What's wrong with having a little fun? Your personal life is none of my business. You don't like me, though, do you? That's your imagination. I've seen every kind of drug abuse. No offense, but you don't even stand out of the pack. <laughs> I'm betting you got money in the same place you got attitude. <coughs> you know, people who quit drinking and people who lose weight, <coughs> they think they're better than the people that couldn't. And because you got out of the projects, you think that anybody <coughs> who didn't <coughs> is weak and stupid. I'm not judging you. Take a breath. <coughs> the only difference between me and you is that I made some bad decisions, and you made some good ones. You make bad decisions every day of your life. Stop doing drugs, <coughs> stop having fun, go back to school and get your GED. Yeah, where's the money coming from? The system's not set up for people like me. <coughs> what are you staring at? Your eyes. There's yellow in the sclera. The liver's failing. Without a transplant, she'll be dead in the next 48 hours. We should increase her immunosuppressants and target more specifically at methotrexate. Yeah, let's do more of what's not working. This is not an autoimmune disease. Her white blood cells are attacking her body. That's autoimmune. First brain, then lungs, now liver. All getting worse and all in two days. It's moving too fast. It's got to be cancer. Lymphomatoid granulomatosis. It's rare even by our standards, but it fits her symptoms. Explains why the steroids aren't working. Poor fingernail growth. A lot of people have bad fingernails. A lot of people don't have three organ systems shutting down. Her blood vessels are taking this thing everywhere. She needs total body radiation. We can't do anything until we can confirm. Running those immunochemistries could take a week. She'll be dead by the time. That doesn't make radiation any safer. OK. Suppose Chase and Cameron are right. Suppose it's an autoimmune disease. What's the biggest danger of total body radiation? It suppresses the immune system, which is what we're trying to do with the steroids anyway. I don't usually put out on my first date, but I gotta say, that is a rad move. Get her consent. Start the radiation. <sighs> the uh, patient is not too thrilled with me. I'll get her consent. Foreman's got personality issues, so you're gonna step in? Patient doesn't like Foreman. I'm interested. Fatigue, hair loss, possibility of damage to the lungs, infertility. All possible side effects of radiation. Why don't you like Dr. Foreman? <coughs> he thinks he's better than he is. How good is he? I don't know. Can we get back to what's wrong with me? There's a small possibility of leukemia sometime in the future. Hardly worth mentioning. You can't say that he thinks he's better than he is if you don't know how good he is. <laughs> no one's as good as he thinks he is. I am. I also get cataracts. Sign here. I don't know. You're telling me how dangerous this is. We're saving your life. We're that good. Sign there. I can't decide. Would you rather 
a pencil or a pen? <laughs> Who's the better, James Bond, Sean Connery, or Daniel Craig? I see, that's not even a decision. It's happening again. I can't. Up her blood thinners, get her down to radiology. The attack will be over in 20 minutes. And she'll want to sign this. <laughs> 